Hello everybody and welcome to a series I'm going to be referring to as Lightmatica Did You Know? As you can see on my hotbar I have a series of arrows and uh, sticks which Lightmatica selection mode or whatever mode it's in is not showing up on screen for the stick. I actually have it on tipped arrow and I've changed that in the configuration menu and you can see that any one of the tipped arrows be it night vision slow falling any one of them doesn't matter it actually sees this as the tool now um what if you've got a schematic you've actually loaded into the world let's do that real quick we'll just load a schematic do this as a i did this for demonstration purposes you forget to lock it and you go over to get in your chest and say you were on actually selection mode so or schematic placement then you go to get in your chest oh it moves on you and you basically just messed up your schematic location easiest way around this and I hopefully all of us do know this you would go into your configuration menu and you could actually lock that in place so that it cannot be moved once you've placed it in your world I like to take this a step further and actually change the configuration menu so that it doesn't see that and it'll you know, because I often forget to lock it in place. So let me go ahead and unload this, get it out of our way. And I like to use this line of text right here within Lightmatica. And what this will do is tell Lightmatica that any stick with the name LM-Tool is the tool, that any standard Minecraft stick is not the tool. So let's go ahead and demonstrate this. We'll go into the configuration menu go down here to the tool item we're going to change this to that and now the air tipped arrows no longer the tool however stick is not the tool the stick with lm tool is the one that i can actually use to change the mode holding control key scrolling the wheel stuff like that or where's area selection we can just select a block that kind of thing and you can in a creative world make this a little more noticeable or if you're mod on a server or you have cheats enabled on a single player world you can give yourself an enchantment glint on your stick now this has no bearing whatsoever within lightmatica if you you can put the enchantment code in the lightmatica menu it's still going to see any stick as being if um with the name lm tool have the enchantment glint or not so Basically, here is the code to give yourself a stick with an enchantment glint, no actual effect whatsoever. Simple. It's essentially the same. Just put it at the end, um, in between the very last brackets, a comma, enchantments, colon, and then square brace and brackets in between that, and you're good to go. And this will give you a stick that has the enchantment glint and also named LM Tool. Now, if you don't have that feature, all you need to do, go to an anvil, name this stick LM-Tool once you've given it the code inside of the menu here. And then that stick will be the only one that is working and it won't stack with the other sticks. And you can pay more attention whenever you're scrolling through your hotbar, you can see the name pop up there. Um, it won't pop up blue unless it's got the enchantment glint, but you get the point. And essentially, that is what this video is all about. 